Hey guys, it's Extreme Strategy here, and today we're checking out the Squigadons for Greenskins mod, made by Bacon God. Now this mod adds in two Squigadons for all of the Greenskin factions, and then a very special Squigadon that goes to Crooked Moon only. First up, we have the Feral Squigadon. Armor piercing causes tear, however, it can rampage. Has an absolute ton of health. Having 19,258 hit points. And then inside of fight, these feral squigadons move very slowly. One gets netted and the other one just kind of comes on in and swipes his face right across the ground, just absolutely hurling zombie pirate deckhands all over the place, tossing them around as if they were nothing. The one that is currently netted is going to break free and then he is going to commence to doing the exact same, just slamming the zombie pirate deckhands all over the place. However, you will notice that they are not doing a whole lot of damage. But simultaneously, they are not taking a whole lot of damage. Meaning that these units are going to play more of a role of pinning down a unit, while the other greenskin soldiers rip them apart. As it will take a very long time for the feral squigadon to die. Next up, we have the normal squigadon. With armor, armor piercing, causes tear, and fire whilst moving. This time, they have 22,640. Four hit points and better armor and leadership than the last Squigadon. However, they do have a little bit less speed. These units also have a special ability, Drop the Boys. And what Drop the Boys does is it spawns in a group of Orc Boys who can now begin to fight alongside of your Squigadon. And they get three charges of these. However, you will not be able to cast this ability if you have a full 20 stack army comp. Also, I have noticed that the Orc Boys do not ever disintegrate like most summons, meaning that they will stay around for a very long time. And the Squigadons can do more damage than the Feral Squigadons, because not only are their stats higher, but they also will be shooting projectiles into the enemy while they are fighting, making these units very, very powerful. Next up, we have the Squigadon that only the Crooked Moon can have, the Dawn Squigadon. The Dawn Squigadon is slightly weaker than the normal Squigadon, and their special ability is Night Gobbo's Landing, which, as the name suggests, drops in Night Goblins to fight alongside of your Dawn Squigadons. And the Dawn Squigadon, like the normal Squigadon, can also pour projectiles into enemy units as well, meaning that they can be fighting and shooting their enemies full of arrows simultaneously making this a very nice add-on for the Crooked Moon, who, as we all know, is not the strongest of Greenskin factions. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe. Go check out the Discord server and this mod. Links to both those in the description below. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day.